Carlitos, good night. How are you? Pretty good? Fine. So, bueno, well, so, so. <laughs> so, so? Are you, still, yeah. are you tired today as well? Yes, teacher, yes. Oh, my God. <laughs> it has been a pretty tough week for you, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, my God. So but but, but uh, in, in this case, mm -hmm. uh, I am tired. I am. I had a headache. I body headache. Oh. oh no, no, teacher. Was, uh, only excuse it for watch the, the the play soccer for El Salvador. <laughs> ah, no way. That's not cute. Uh -huh. Yeah, and to be the, later, right? All, all, all the people today there are. Yeah, many, many I think excuses. so. <laughs> yeah, my husband said that is it was. That was a cut in a rush, a traffic jam. Yeah. Everywhere you go, no matter where. Oh my goodness. And I didn't know why. Because you know what? I, I was about to order pizza for the liver, but nobody wants to come here. And uh and everything that I ordered, it was too expensive. And I was like, why are they doing like that? And I didn't remember that today it is a um soccer match, right? A soccer. Yes. United States or no? Yes, United States. Oh, that's the reason why. So right now you're watching the football match. <laughs> Only watches, eh? No, uh -huh. no, no. Only watches. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that's cool. But also, yeah. will appreciate that you come here. Today's class is amazing. Yeah, mm -hmm. at, least, at least I can listen to your beautiful voice. <laughs> 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 that's awesome, Carlita. Thank you so much. I also yeah. have... Um, Dinita here. Welcome to today's class, Dinita. It's, I'm so happy to have you. I have Jesse. Hi, Han. Hi. Are you watching the, the soccer match by any chance as well? Oh, no. No, no, no. No, no. <laughs> no it's there. fine for you. No, right? Uh -huh. You don't like that. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, but I'm so happy that I, I can see you today. Also, I have Jesse. Yeah, here. me too. And Brie, <laughs> yeah, I'm so happy. We're gonna wait for some all the guys. Ah, Carlitos, finally I can see your beautiful face. Sure. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> the the polish shirt color blue for the Salvador. Oh, for the Salvador. Ah. All righty. Today I have a really amazing company today, you know. What? Yeah, I have an amazing yeah. company here. Let me show it to you. Allow me just a couple of minutes. Come on, baby. Come on, sweetie. Come on. Come on, Hi, girl. Hi, <laughs> <laughs> Carlito. Carlito. Oh, to, 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 today I, I watch the, the class and the and the so Yeah, me too. <laughs> also, Brie. Look who I have Brie, here. We sell that. Look what? at look at the, the, the football game. Yeah. What's her uh -huh. name? Oh, his name. Is her okay, name? Her name name is Sassy. Oh, ah, so cute. Sassy. Thank you. Hi, guys. So beautiful. Thank you so much. I'm leaving because I need to go back to sleep. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, you see, he's she's huge. She's huge. Woo! <laughs> Thank you, Sassy. Um, All right. So okay. cute. You're like, uh, do you have pets, right? I think so. Yeah, I, yeah. I have cats. Or oh, cats. Yeah. Oh, oh cats! <laughs> oh wow! No, I only have one cat. Her name is Sassy, and uh, two dogs. Shesno that is here, but he's sleeping. That you cannot imagine. You know what? He likes to sleep, but under the bed. And he's mm -hmm. already big, but I don't know. I think he has a flexibility on their back legs mm -hmm. that he's like. If he's doing, he's like mm -hmm. a gymnastic. Because he can do the the slip, the, the, the like this. He can open the legs like this. So he just like doing uh -huh. like, and he get inside the bed. Well, <laughs> under the bed. So that's the, his favorite place to sleep since he was a little baby. Mm -hmm. I don't know why. Yeah, I don't know why, but mm. it's his favorite place. I think mm. he's looking for a space where it's quiet, fresh, and at the same time, not too much light. 
that, that could be the reason why. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, uh, so I'm sorry, but you're not going to meet him today. Uh, maybe next week. <laughs> All righty. <laughs> I think uh, who's barking? Another dog, right? Maybe Dina no? or Carlitos? Yeah, I have a, uh, one dog. Her oh, name is Dante. It's Dante. a big old. <laughs> oh, that's the reason why. Dante. I, oh, Dante. Terrible. I know it's terrible, but it will be a little adorable. I think so. Oh. That he has a good mood or bad mood? What? Do you know what I'm asking you? Does he have a good mood or bad mood? Good mood. Good mood? Yeah. Okay. So that's good. Mood, Carlito, is like, is he happy? Is like he's grumpy? Mm -hmm. Like that. Uh -huh. Okay. About his personality. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh. Yes, that's right. Very good, guys. I have Alex. Hey, Mr. Hacko. Thank you so much for joining today's class. It's a pleasure to see you also. I have Jesse and I have Bree. Good evening, class. Good evening. Bree and evening. Mr. Antonio. They're at the same time watching the soccer match today, you know? <laughs> good evening. No. Good evening, uh, Bree. Look at it. The pressure is too. <laughs> Look yeah. at this. Uh -huh. Imagine the soccer match is exactly at the same time as the English class. No, no way. Um, please, please uh, just a moment. I, I, I was a problem. You had a problem with, with the internet? internet. Okay, no problem. That's okay. Take your time. No rush. It's excuse, teacher. The, put the television. It, no, it's not the excuse. The TV. Alex is not like you. Come problem on. With my <laughs> <laughs> I get it. I, get it. I know. <laughs> Bree, did you have any? Uh, you, did you take a nap today? What? Did you take a nap today? Uh, for class? Uh, okay. Sorry. No. No? Today was really um, busy as well? No. No? No. So you, today you work? I. ¿Cómo se dice? Ya estoy acostada. <laughs> I'm already laid down on my bed. <laughs> Say it one more time. <laughs> Say it. I already laid down on my bed. Lay down. I already laid down on yes. my bed. Lay, lay down. Um, I, I just trying to use my imagination <laughs> to try to see uh, Miss Bree laying on her bed like a beauty, right? Oh, <laughs> oh, right. And you are with your blanket, blanket, colcha, blanket. I know. No, hamaca. Hamaca? Oh, my God. That is one of my favorite places to sleep, you know, hamaca. Hey, Jorgito. It's cold and it's raining. Ah, that's the reason why. <laughs> yeah, when it's cold and it's raining, it's really hard to be focused. So what you what you like is like a, a really good hot chocolate or a cup of coffee, right? And uh, you want <laughs> your blanket or milk. Yeah, if you prefer milk. And with a, <laughs> with a huge piece of chocolate cake, that would be amazing. Mm. Me voy a poner guapo porque estaba viendo los videos que subieron a YouTube y qué vergüenza. Ah, uh, well, I, I just uploaded because it's supposed to be like in your classes, right? That's why you need to be like beautiful all the time. Yeah. I need to stay beautiful. <laughs> no, but you're beautiful. So don't worry about that. She she said that she thinks it's a completely disaster, but no way. <laughs> oh, you see, you look beautiful. Matter. Oh, that matter, right, it's not right. a problem. Yeah, of course not. What I really like is that you put in practice everything that we learned today. Okay, guys, remember <laughs> that yesterday, uh, the last thing that we saw basically was regarding Alex's questions, right? About the difference between fewer and the feeling of less. Do you remember that? Yeah. Fewer and less. Exactly. Basically, yeah. those yeah. are the things that we call expression of quantity, right? Less and fewer. Right. But we're going to do a recap because um, what we were double checking yesterday, basically, is that we use those things when we are talking about um, transportation services or any kind of problems that we do have, guys in our country, in our village, or in our city, okay? But I'm going to make a recap. 
um, do you remember fewer? Do we use for countdowns or for uncountdowns? Do you remember that? Um, countdown. Countdowns, very good, exactly. Yes. What about less? Less is uncountable. Exactly, Nubi, uncountable. Exactly. And yes. both of them will be would mean the same. Fewer means not too many. And less means not too much. Okay? So you is exactly the same. The difference is that you're gonna use fewer, that is one of the expression of quantity with countable nouns, and less you're going to use it with uncountable nouns. Okay. I wrote it down right now already in the, in the chat. Yeah, I'm gonna share right now my screen because I want you guys to pay attention to those things. We need to have like, like the basic grammar part in order for us to have like, um, like tools that we can use to talk about, for example, public transportation in El Salvador, public transportation in Santa Ana, what Japan, Sonsonate, I don't know, right? Those kind of things, yeah. So let me um, share right now my screen with you. Welcome, Vane. Welcome, Nelsie. Welcome, Rocio. It's been a pleasure to have you guys. Thank you. Ooh, yay. There you go. Okay, can you see it, guys? Yeah? Yeah. Okay, cool. Different yeah. between less and fewer. Exactly. So just as we talk about that, we, talk, we know the fewer means not as many. And we use it for accountable nouns, for accountable. We, we saw the example of the cookie monster, remember? Mm -hmm. Mr. Cookie Monster was told to eat fewer cookies. That means not too many cookies or not as many. And less means not as much. And we use it with uncountable nouns, such as like milk, for example. And we have also the example with Mr. Cookie Monster. Could you give mm -hmm. Cookie Monster less milk the next time? Mm -hmm. May I ask you guys right now, do you understand the difference between fewer and less? Yeah. Yep. Okay. Now, guys, yeah, is everybody understand that or not? Yeah. Okay, cool. Okay, guys. Yes, go ahead, Alex. Mm -hmm. I'm going to give it to you right now an example. You see, guys, we have the expression of quantity, we have it with count nouns and we have mm -hmm. it with uncount nouns. If you see, guys, many. Always you're going to use with count noun. Much mm -hmm. is going to be with uncountable. Yes. Fewer count nouns, count noun. less, less uncount nouns. More, mm. you're gonna you can use it with both. Both. More, it, it could be used with countable and non-countable. And also enough, guys. However, I want you guys to pay attention on this. Remember that countable nouns we can pluralize. Plural is uh, just uh -huh. there are. Exactly. And singular, you say it's, exactly. It's, it's, However, in count uncountable nouns, you cannot pluralize it. Okay. Okay, so that is really important. And also to emphasize more the quantity of expressions, we can use like an adverb in this case that is going to be too, too, too many, too much. Uh, somebody's uh, okay. Sorry, I don't see good the screen. Oh, Alex, you cannot see the screen. Okay. Let me just for a couple of minutes. Would you like me to make it, guys, a little bit bigger so it's is a uh, more visualized? Okay, let me just a couple of minutes. Let me try to put in such a big ones here so Alex can see it. Could you could you send the WhatsApp group, please? Of course, I will. Definitely, I will, Alex. Hundred okay. percent. Yeah, mm. I can always do. There you go. Is it is it is it better, guys? Is it, is it better? It's better, yes. Yeah. Yes, yes. But, yes. but yes, go there ahead. There are a line, yeah, yeah, it's okay. It's okay? Okay, cool. Yeah. Okay, guys. Okay. So let's read the example. Alice, could you please be so kind to read for me the first line of uh, countable now? The first sentence, please. And I, I don't see the screen. Uh, there are all... To, no, I, you, I don't. You, you cannot see I it. I don't care. Okay, no. don't worry. I'm gonna I'm gonna help you right now. 
Really? Like uh, very rarely. Okay, give me just one moment. Let me give it but, to you. Let, let me try to make a screenshot and I will send it to you guys. So let me just a couple of minutes. There we go. Okay. All right, I send it to the WhatsApp. Do you have it? Okay. Yeah? <laughs> there are too many cars. There are too many cars. I could continue? Yes, but, but do me a favor. Do not pronounce there it like a question way. Try, try to pronounce it like a regular way, like a, like a sentence way. Do it again, please. Okay. Uh, there are too many cars. No. There many, should many. be no. fewer a. cars. Uh -huh. no, we need more subway lines. Allow me a couple of minutes, Alex. Okay. Do me a favor. Just read for me the first sentence. There are too many cars. Can you please say it? Many, many cars. Uh -huh. Exactly. Alex, can you please repeat it one more time? There are too many cars. Repeat again, Alex. Alex, are you with me? Uh, no. I, I have a problem with my internet. Your internet. Sorry. That's okay, I understand. Uh, but can you see the... Um, the picture that I sent it to you. Yes. Okay. So do but, me a uh, uh -huh. um, I, I don't listen. Cool. Ah, it's hard for you to listen to us. What about now? Yeah. I, I don't. Oh. Is it okay now? Okay. This one. Yeah. Okay, cool. So do me a favor, Alex. Can you please read for me again okay. the first sentence? There are too many cars. Can you please say it? Okay, only the first sentence. Yes, only the first sentence, please. Okay, there are too many cars. Very good. But Alex, do me a favor. Trata de decirlo like a sentence, no como question. There are too many ah, cars okay. like that. Okay, there are too many cars. Very good. Hoy trata de decirme la primera de non-countable nouns, please. There are too much traffic. Um, there is too much traffic. Very good. Excellent. Uh, the second sentence for countable nouns, Carlitos, please. Thank you, Alex. Please. There should be fewer cars. Very good. Now about the second sentence for the uncountable now. There should be less pollution. Very good. Excellent. A third sentence. Novi, could you please be so kind to read it for us? We need more subway lines. Very good. Now the third sentence for the non-countable names. We need more public transportation. Excellent job. And the last one. Um, Mane, could you please be so kind to read it for me, the count nouns? Okay, there aren't enough buses. Very good. Now the last one for the non-countable ones. There isn't enough parking. Very good. Excellent job, guys. Good job. Now let's do us a favor. If you see, guys, there are too many cars. What does it mean? When you say there are too many cars, that means that we need more cars or we need less cars? Muchos. More. Muchos. Tenemos yeah. muchos, right? Too many. So Too do many. we need more? Necesitamos más? No. 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 And no. the reason why no. we had too many, what is the consequence? There is too much traffic, right? Traffic. Mm. Pollution. 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 Exactly. And so in order for us to problem. help traffic, we need, we, there should be fewer cars, right? Menos carros. Yeah. There should be less pollution, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very more good. Is, more more stress. Mm -hmm. stress. Exactly. Uh, stress, stress, yes, definitely. 
Okay, guys. So now that you you have guys, we have more expression of quantities. No solamente son estos. Hay más. Pero con estos nos quedamos por el momento. So guys, I have eight sentences. Do me a favor. Could you please help me um, complete the sentences? There For example, they policies. are too many too police many officers. Police officers. Police officers. Police officers? Many. Too many. many. Okay, what too about many. there should be? There should be. There should be what? Mm -hmm. Too many too. To, no. Fewer. 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 Very oh, good. Fewer Fewer cars five. in the city. Excellent. Fewer. There is public transportation. There is too much transportation. Too much. Okay. The government no. needs to build highways. Needs to be more. More highways. More highways. More highways. More highways. Very more good. Highways. More highways. There more should be high. noise. And there should be less, should be less, less. 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 exactly. Less. Less. Because yes. remember, noise we cannot yes. count, right? It's uncountable now. Yeah. Yes. Excellent. Yes. What about number six? The city needs public parking garages. It's some more public. No. No. More. 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 Exactly. More. More public. Exactly. Because remember, the public parking garages, oh, it is countable. All right. There is oh, yeah. air pollution in the city. There is too much. There is too much. Excellent. There is too much. Is too and the much. last one. There are, there are cars there are many on the streets. Cars. There, there are many. many. There, there are, are many too many. Cars. Too many. Very good. Very good. Too many. Now, guys, let's practice just the pronunciation of this. How many O's do I have here? How many O's do I have here? How many O's? Quantas O's? Two. Two. Exactly. I have two, right? Because we have two twos in English, right? We have the one with one O. That means para. Remember when you are writing an email, right? Or when you're writing a letter, two para. And then we have the double two, T-O-O. -O which means, guys, that this is an adverb, adverb of quantity. Mm -hmm. It's un adverbio de cantidad, right? Y la, pre la primera, T-O, solo con una O, is a preposition. No. Uh, yes, exactly, preposition, yes. I'm, I'm just thinking in Spanish and in English at the same time. So, the first two, T-O, is two. Yeah, let's straight to the head. Two, you see? Two. But the second one with two O's is two. You see? Two. Two. Lo alargas más la pronunciación. Two. Two. Too much. Too much. Too many. Too much. Right? Too many. Exactly. Too. So with double O, you need to like pronounce it a little bit longer. Two. 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 Okay. And the first one, the T-O is two. Like that. Two. Two. Yes. Very two. good. Mm -hmm. I just want to emphasize that because also, guys, we need to work on the pronunciation. So very good. Too many, okay. too much. Too and many. errant too enough, many. isn't enough. Yes. Remember yes. That, that is errant enough for countable, yes. right? And isn't enough for uncountable, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, Alex, I know. Don't worry. Take your time. However, when we pronounce it, I want you guys to join the two... Um, the two words. So let's go back. And I want you guys to do me a favor. Let me go back and, okay, I'm gonna open here. All righty, so this is, is, you see here, there you go, there you go, this one. We have here, right? We have here. So when you pronounce it, I want you to pronounce it together. Aaron, enough, isn't enough. You see? Enough. Okay, isn't let's enough. Practice. Let's practice. There aren't enough buses. There isn't enough parking. There isn't enough parking. There isn't enough parking. Exactly. That's what it is. There isn't enough parking. Mm -hmm. Okay. Excellent job, guys. Let's continue with it. There are enough buses. There are enough. There okay. isn't enough. So just remember that isn't enough. There isn't is, enough parking. Uh -huh. It is for, um, for uncountable nouns, and are enough is for countable nouns. All right, guys. 
We're going to work right now. Okay, do me a favor. Um, how many we are right now? 12, right? Without me, because with me is 13. So I want you guys to do me a favor. Um, who lives in Santa Ana? Can you please raise your hand? No, nobody? Okay. Who lives in Aguachapan? <laughs> no. Who? Nubia. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Me, teacher. Nubia. I live in Santa Ana. Nubia in Martita. Nubia in Santa in Aguachapan. And Martita in yeah. Santa Ana. No. Uh -huh. No. No. Wait, wait. Aguachapan. No. No. So, Aguachapan, Nubia, and Martita. Vanessa, I live in Chalchuapa. Ah, Chalchuapia, okay. Aguachapan, Nubia, right? I live Concepción de Ataco. Ah, oh, so that means Martita and Nubia, they live close, we can say it, right? Nubia and Martita, okay. Okay, that, that, that is the reason why I ask you right now. Let me just a couple of minutes. And here, uh-huh. Now do me a favor. Um, Vanessa, you live in Chalchuapa, you said, right? Santa Ana. San, oh, Santa Ana. Who lives in Santa Ana? My mom. Nelly, no? Where do you live, Nelly? Um, I live in Ciudad Arce, but it's Department of Libertad. Ciudad Arce, all righty, very good. Vanessa lives in um, Chalchuapa. Where do you live, Brie? In San Salvador. San Salvador. What about you, Carlitos Antonio? Where do you live? San Salvador, too. San Salvador. And you, Jorgito? San Salvador, too. San Salvador. Tanya? I live in Me Mexicano. Mexicano, San Salvador. <laughs> San Salvador. All right, very good. What about yeah. Yesenia? I live in Ciudad Arce. Ciudad Arce, uh -huh. like, like Nelsi, right? Uh -huh. So, Yesenia and uh, Nelsi. Okay, and Dinita, where do you live? I live in San Salvador too. San Salvador, okay. So let's do something. Guys, I will send you, uh, you saw uh, um, a questions, right, or sentences. I'm going to send it to you as sentences right now in the WhatsApp. And those sentences, guys, basically, it is the first part of the sentence. You will need to complete those sentences with the information of your own city. Right? That's what I was asking you. Where do you live? Because um, Chalchuapa has a different, um, we can say, services issues, right? Maybe the transportation in Chalchuapa is not the same of transportation in San Salvador, right? Or in, in Huachapan is not the same of uh, Mexicanos, right? So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm going to uh, divide you in groups right now, but before I do that, I'm gonna send it to you right now. Who's sleeping, Bri? Me. Ah, <laughs> Nelsie, Nelsie. You're not going to sleep. I'm about to, to let you know why. Okay, I'm going to send it to you right now, guys. Basically, this is what I'm going to send it to you. I will send you eight sentences, and you need to write sentences about the city or the town that you are living. Okay? So that's why I'm going to divide it in, in groups. And for example, um, Martita and Nubi, they're going to talk about Aguachapan, for example. They're going, everything, guys, everything, girls, all the sentences you need, will need to think about Aguachapan, okay? However, Dinita, Jorjito, um, Carlitos, etc., they live in San Salvador, right? In San Salvador. So everything, guys, will be related to San Salvador. Are you with me? Están conmigo? Yeah? Would you like me to explain it to you again? Les explico de nuevo? No. Yes or no? No. Guys, yes. you understand that? Sí, ¿se entiende? Yes. 
Ah, no, 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 ese, ese yes no me convence. ¿Qué, ¿Qué es lo que van a hacer? ¿Can somebody repeat it to me? Yes. Dale, go ahead, Jorgito. Jorgito, ¿qué vamos a hacer ahorita? Ah, uh, we talk about, talking about our city. Very good. I'm going to um, share right now this, the first sentence with you as an example, guys, and then I'm going to separate with you into groups, okay? So let me just a couple of minutes. Okay. For example, guys, let's talk about San Salvador. The first one, the city should provide more, more what, guys? Think about the transportation, eh, the parking, the traffic, everything related to San Salvador. Uh -huh. So if you're talking about the first sentence, how you're going to complete that idea? ¿Cómo van a completar esa idea? The city should provide more. La ciudad debería de proveer más. Más what? Más que? Parking. Mm. More what? Parking. More, more parking, parking spaces, for example, right? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Exactly. So this is that's what I want, guys. I want you guys to complete each sentences with the information about your city. And then, guys, we're going to compare. Okay? Who has more problems on Salvador, or Huachapan, on Sonata, San Miguel, etc. So do me a favor, I'm going to share right now. Uh, what I'm gonna do, I'm going to create a groups right now. There you go. So how many will be? Six. All right, so let me check it out. Yes, I'm going to assign it. Let me see. Mm, Nubi and Martita. Martita, where is Nubi here? Nubi, I don't see you. Is Nubi here? No, Nubi is not yes, here. Yes, yes, teacher. I'm here. Mm, I do not see you on my list. Okay, I'm gonna, I don't know, you have it here? No, I don't have it here. Hmm, have Dina, Dina, oh yes, I do, I have it here. There you go. Okay, then let me check the second one. I have Jenny, Yesenia, and Elsie, right? All righty. So just Senia and Nelsie. Great job. And then I'm going to okay, assign it everybody. Mm -hmm. There you go. Okay. All righty. And I will sign it. Good. So Tanya and Vanessa, they're going to work together. Okay, guys, I have assigned it to you right now. Pair, could you please accept the invitation and try to work on the sentences that we're discussing right now? Nancy, you need to enter with Jesenia. Uh -huh. More parking. Yeah. En la segunda podemos poner, we have too many cars. ¿Verdad? Porque hay muchos carros. Muchos carros. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Too many cars. And in the third one, we can put there's too much traffic jam, que ella dijo que significaba <coughs> trabazón. Exactly. Pero, <laughs> pero en Aguachapán no hay trabazones. <laughs> bien, bien hay horas, hay horas. <coughs> que, por ejemplo, las seis de la tarde o mediodía, sí hay bastante trabazón. <coughs> Qué, qué chivo. Sí. Vaya, vaya, vamos a contestar las la cuestiones de la, de la que mandó la teacher. Okay. Solo, que, solo que yo no lo tengo aquí, permita. Mm. 
expression of quantity. Creo um, que la dice la. Ah, ya. Vaya, aquí tengo yo la primera. ¿Me escucha? Sí, va. Sí, sí, sí. Ok. Dice: The city should be provided more. Um, podría ser. Memphis say an idea, she say parking, but I... Okay. It's okay. The city should provide more parkings uh, for our cars. It's, it's okay. Uh -huh. well, Alex, do you also live in San Salvador? Yeah, I live in Santa Ana. Ah, in Santa Ana. <laughs> in Santa Ana. Uh, sí, Santana City. Ah, and Bree in San Salvador, right? Yes. Okay, so yeah. maybe you can think about the common uh, problems that is that you have in Santa Ana and the common problems that you have in, in San Salvador. And then maybe you have the same things, right? Maybe. But there's oh. no parking, I don't know. I remember that I went to Santa Ana. I, well, my, my, my grandparents from my dad's side, they used to be from Santa Ana. And yes. I remember that there was not, a, not a, enough spaces for parking. I remember that. Yeah, the, the spaces yeah. is very short. <laughs> yeah, I know. And I, I, well, when you want to like ch check on the directions, the car, you need to like almost put la trompita del carro, right? On the corner because the, <laughs> the, the streets are really tight. So muy chiquitas, son muy estrechas. I yeah. remember that. Okay, so I gave you an idea. <laughs> Continue talking, okay? I'll be double checking the other guys right now. Thank okay, you. Tisha. Thank you. Fever, es el, fever, es que eso lo explicaron ayer, perdón. Ajá. Eh, bueno, ayer no tiene, he perdido dos clases. Es como... Yeah, I will kill you. No me Pero yo lo dije el auspicio. Hi, but, no, but don't say fever. Okay. Because fever is fiebre. It's fewer. 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 Ah, yes. ya. Yeah. Es... De, de... Okay. Ah, fewer, que que... yeah. Ajá. She remembers like Saturday Night Live, right? Como la fiebre okay. de fiebre de sábado yeah, por la noche, yeah, but no yeah. way. Yeah. There is to be fewer. 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 Yes, fewer. Yeah, fewer. fewer. There should be fewer. Fewer okay, what? Fewer. There should be fewer. There should be fewer. Remember, fewer, fewer is with countable nouns and less with uncountable nouns. Incountable. Okay. Um, there should be fewer. I don't know. <laughs> I don't I know, think... use your imagination, come on. Yes, yes, teacher, but at the moment, I don't know what to choose. Only one will be fine. There should be fewer. fewer. Dinita and Carlito, how's it going? I'm fine. Fine? We, uh... Are you discussing about the football soccer match today or what? No, just kidding. <laughs> two, two, <laughs> two. <laughs> this should be right. Uh huh. <laughs> Less, no, fewer soccer matches during English classes. I'm just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All righty, guys. Very good. Uh, which uh, which uh, sentence are you right now? Which number? Yeah. Number five. How, how many have you answered? ¿Cuántas han respondido? All. Oh. Oh, you, you already finished? Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Okay, let me go back to the other guys. Okay. And I think we're going to come back together. All righty. Thank you. All righty. Uh -huh. I have Nuvi, Carlito, Zinita. Mm -hmm. I'm waiting for the rest of the guys right now. I think they're still talking about that, right? Uh -huh. I'm gonna send them a message. Come back, babies. 
I'm back. Hey guys, let me ask you, how was the experience? Is it good? Interesting, right? Good. Yeah, now good. that I have Dina and Carlitos, we, they live in San Salvador, right? Yeah. And Nubi lives in uh, Huachapan, right? Okay, I have everybody here. <laughs> everybody joined today's class. Excellent. Guys, do you like the, the experience? Yeah. Yeah, it, it needs to like, you need to uh, practice your writing, but at the same time you're speaking. So now guys, I want to hear the different ideas or the different sentences that you come up depends on your um, city or town situation. For example, Jorgito. Do me a favor, Jorgito. Okay. You, I think you work with who, Jorgito? With Carlitos. Ah, with Mr. Charlie Brown. All right. <laughs> so, uh, so talking about the first one, in San Salvador, Carlitos and Jorgito, they should provide more what, according to you? Uh, parking lots. More parking lots. More uh, parking lots. More parking lots. Parking Guys, may I ask you, is it the same problem in Santa Ana, Alex? Yes, it's, yeah? the, it's the same problem. The same problem. What about in uh, Aguachapan, Nubi? In, mm -hmm. Yes, teacher, more parking. More parking. parking. What about uh, Nelsie, what about you? Uh, hello. Yes, but but we uh, we have another problem. Too. Okay. The, what, okay. We, what is the problem that you put? Supermarket. There should be more pro provide more supermarkets. Why? Yes. Yes, because in the cities, um, it's only, only one. The, yes, it's there only is only one. one. Really? Yes. Yeah. Despensa See? familiar. And that's it. Yes. No, yes. no, this, no, the Spencer they don't want no Walmart, no selections. No, 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 no. You have to move lower this if you want uh, to change another. You see, guys, and in San Salvador, we can we can just pick right. There is a Walmart, Price Mart. Oh, you see, uh -huh. yeah. interesting, interesting. You see what we're just uh, detecting. Uh -huh. All right, mm -hmm. what about guys? We have too many, we have too many. What? Uh, Tania, in San Salvador, we have too many what? Miss Tania. We have too many cars. We have too many cars. cars. Mm -hmm. yeah. Is it the same problem in Aguachapan, in uh, Ataco, in San Salvador, Salvador. in Santa Ana? In all we have too many cars. <laughs> we have too many cars. Yes. And and mm -hmm. motor motorcycle taxis. And, mm -hmm. and motorcycle taxis, exactly. You're right about that. What about taxis? Do we have a lot of taxis? How many taxis? All right. Yes. Yes, we and do. Moto taxi. Moto taxi. Yeah. Very good. What about uh there's too much? There is too much what, guys? Informal commerce in city arts. Uh -huh. In city arts. arts. What about you, Jorgito? There is too much? Mm. Remember, too much is with uncountable nouns. There, there is too much pollution. There is too much pollution, yes. <laughs> Everywhere, right? What about in Ataco, Vanessa? There is too much pollution or no? No, Chalchuapa. In Chalchuapa, yeah, but there is too much pollution or no? Uh, no. Not really, right? Mm -hmm. No. Because there are not too many cars, like in San Salvador, for example. Ah, yes. yes. Mm -hmm. You're comparing, right? Comparing the cities is such a big difference. All right, what yeah. about, guys? Um, nice. Yes, Alex. Teacher in my city. Yes. There's there's too much holes in the street. <laughs> too much holes in the street or too many holes? Mm, too many. Oh okay. too many. Too many remember, account. yeah, pluralized. Remember countable and uncountable nouns. But very good job. Okay. What about there isn't enough? There isn't enough what guys? 
gas stations. There isn't enough gas stations. May I ask you, is it plural? Is it countable or non-countable now? <gasps> it's countable. Aha, uh -huh, so they aren't yes. enough. Very yes. good. What about there isn't enough? There isn't enough what? Uh huh. Public public parking. Public parking. Mm -hmm. Are you sure? Public Is it parking? countable or non-countable now? Just have to figure non, it out. Non-countable. Public parking is non-countable. No. Uh huh. I'm just asking you. Uh huh. Any other idea? There isn't enough. What? A space for work. Mm. No. You need to double check if the noun is countable or non countable. What about there isn't enough pure air? Mm. Mm? Pure air, right? Non countable. Exactly, non countable mm. because you cannot count mm. the air. Pure okay. air, right? Because, of course, because there's a, there is a, too much pollution, right? But yeah. teacher, yes, but girl. Enough that we use countable and not countable. Yes. Yes. But you gotta figure it out. What is the verb that you use first? You, you, for example, you use aren't enough if you're talking about countables, and if and you use isn't enough if you're talking about uncountable. Okay, oh, I, yeah. I mm -hmm. understand. Well, oh, yeah. Exactly. Well, it's, 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 That's why it's, it's, I said there isn't enough pure air. Mm -hmm. What about there should be fewer what, guys? Fewer? Fewer what? In, in San Salvador, in uh, Chalchuapa, in Santa Ana. There should be fewer informal stores. Very good, excellent. Because fewer you use with countable nouns. What about we don't have enough? We don't have enough what? If you say that the city should provide more parking spaces, you we said we have enough. What in it Exactly. What about you, Dina? Yes, go ahead. Los gestores de tráfico, no sé cómo se dice en inglés. Ah, police traffic officers. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. So there should be less what, guys? Traffic. <laughs> there should be less traffic. Yeah. Jorgito, I'm I, you're thinking, right? It's, it's complicated, right? Mm -hmm. But at the same time, it's interesting because we are learning vocabulary to talk about problems, real problems that we do have in our city, that we have in our country. And we need more what? Police Bicycle. officers? Bicycle. 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 Yeah. Bicycle. Yes. You know what? We can like two, kill two birds at the same time. Or matar dos pajaros de un tiro. Right? We can yeah. like reduce the contamination, the pollution. Yeah. And at the same time, and, and we're going to improve our health. We can improve pollution. our health, right? Less uh -huh. pollution. Less pollution. Less traffic. Less traffic. Exactly. And you know what? We will be in shape. <laughs> Estaremos en forma with a great legs, yeah. con buenas piernas. <laughs> <laughs> right? And then we can make a concourse. Yeah, hacemos un concurso. A ver quién tiene las piernas más chivas. I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right, so you see. Very good, guys. Excellent. I, was it easy? Fue fácil? Mm, no, right. No, no. Because this time no. you need to think, right? <laughs> Tienes que pensar un poquitico más. Sabes la construction in the sentences. You have the vocabulary. But to think about the, what exactly you need to change, what exactly you don't have in your country, in your city, uh, to think about real problems, guys, that we have, is, that is the, the hard part, right? Eso es lo más difícil. Teacher, yes, uh, what, uh, what we say, uh, and mass order in the traffic. Ah, there should be more order. More order. More order. You can say less cows. 
Yeah. Thank yeah. You. You're welcome. So, guys, now let's gonna practice some listening. Um, I'm going to play the audio three times. These guys basically is going to talk about transportation, transportation, but in Singapore. Okay. And I want you guys to pay attention about what they say in general. And then we're going to discuss that. Okay. I just want you to do that. That's all. Then I'm going to share something extra with you. Okay. Okay. Uh, I think everybody's like, <sighs> right? Please. Yeah. Please. Please. Okay, let's break up a little bit right now. Let's play some games. Okay, let's play Simon Says, okay? There you go. Okay, hey guys, what's this? How you say this in, in English? ¿Cómo se dice frente? Forehead, yeah. Okay. What is this? Okay. Hair. Hair. What is this? No. No. Nose. Nose. Don't Nose. say no say, okay? Nose. Nose. <laughs> All right. What is this? Chin. Checks. Chin. Very good. Chin. What is this? Chin. Chin. Menton. Oh, yes. Chin. Menton, but it's chin. Yeah, very good. What is this? Mm. Tongue. 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 All right. What are these? Teeth. 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 What is this? Ear. 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 And what is this? Head. 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 And this? Neck. 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 And this? Shoulders. Shoulders. All right. Very good. So enough. Okay. We have more parts of the body, but it will be enough right now. So, re remember the rules, okay? Touch the part of your body that you listen to me that I said, not that you watch me too, that I touch. And be careful, because if I said, touch your nose, but I didn't say Simon Seth, you're loose, okay? Ready? All right. Simon says, touch your forehead. Guys, hurry up. Porque si no te apuras, pierdes. Oh. Okay? Mm -hmm. All right. One more time. Simon says, touch your forehead. <laughs> Tania, you lose because you didn't touch your forehead. Aha, I see. Very good. Aha. Simon says, touch your chin. Chin. Ah, aha. <laughs> ah, you lose dinner. Yay, bye. I said chin or chicks. <laughs> All right, Simon says, touch your chicks. All right, Simon says, touch your hair. You lose, Jesse. Bye. <laughs> because you touch your cheeks not your hair Simon says touch your neck touch your tongue <laughs> Carlito bye bye Tani bye Dinita <laughs> remember I said I had to say Simon says yeah. If I say touch your tongue, you're loose. <laughs> All right. Okay, guys. Are you more awake right now? See? Thank my coma feeling. Yeah. Uh, yeah, a little bit, right? Yeah, ya casi hemos terminado. No preocupen. Very good. I know, I know, guys, that for most of you has been a really hard week, ¿verdad? Ha sido una week muy difícil, right? But you know what? I'm happy no. every time that I more, see you. More interesting. I know. Every time that I see you, I'm happy. Why? Because <laughs> all of us are have a really busy, busy, busy day, week and busy life. But if you show here, guys, it's because you want to learn. If you show your commitment. And that is really healthy. You know what? Who's with me? Come on, whiskey. Okay, you're gonna meet my other one of my other pets. <laughs> mm. His name is Whiskey. Dog. Thank you Whiskey. so much. Oh. Hi, everybody. It's beautiful. I love you. Give me a kiss. 
Mm, thank you. Oh, yeah. cute. <laughs> he always gives me a kiss. I, I present to us my dog. Your dog. Okay, come on, buddy. Uh, no. I'm going to Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, he looks like Paco. <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a girl. Uh, uh, oh, so it would be like Taka. Sophie, Taka? <laughs> no, just kidding. <laughs> oh, she's lovely. How old is she? Uh, she she's she, uh, her, no, it's its name. Her name, yes. Is, uh, it's Brownie. Brownie, of course, because of the color of her skin, right? Yeah. <laughs> Are you going to give the classes whiskey? Yeah? You're going to be Mr. Teacher Whiskey today? Okay. Hey. Hey, I love you, baby. Oh. <laughs> I love him so much that you cannot imagine. He sleep with me, leg with leg. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, guys. Thank you, Whiskey. Stay here. So now, guys. I can't see your phone. Yeah? I'm going I'm to send it to you. Uh, uh, no. I will, I will send it to you a picture, okay? okay. All righty, guys. So let's continue yeah. with that. Uh, 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 I'm going to send right now with you the information that I want to share with you. May I ask you guys, which we need. What, what type of transportation do we have here in El Salvador? Do we have a, a subway system? No, right? No. no. Mm, no. Taxi service? No. Only bus. Yeah. Bus yeah. system? Taxi. Bus system, yeah. Aha. Uh -huh. Yes. Train system. Over system. No train Facilit in the future. Uh, parking. Yeah. Aha. Uh -huh. no. Facilities for pedestrians. Not mm. much. You, you know what facilities for pedestrians are? Saben qué es eso? No. 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 Facilities for pedestrians are guys. Para los peatones. Oh. Pedestrians are peatones in Spanish, in English, sorry. Tenemos facilidades para los peatones beside the sidewalk? Or the zebra mm. walk? Or the crosswalk? Crosswalk no. is donde usted pasa con peatón. Yeah. yeah, it's in the, 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 in the zebra. All the streets the zebra. have that. Aha, uh -huh. but we do have more than that or no? More. Tenemos more. más que eso? We need more, right? We need, we need more. more. We need more. Definitely, we need yeah, more. We we have enough. Are you sure? <laughs> okay, guys, I sent it to you the third picture. You don't mind if you can check it if you receive it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Cool. We can say pasarela. Ah, how do you say pasarela? pasarela. Runway. <laughs> Runway. Yeah. Bye. 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 Uh -huh. But this is the modelaje. Yeah. How you say pasarela in English? Uh huh. Crossway. Crossway. Mm -hmm. Crossway. Crossway. Exactly. Very good. So, guys, what I sent it to you basically, it's uh, there are sentences, but not all of them are true. Okay. If you see on the first sentence, you 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 see that we have like a check in false, right? Tenemos un cheque donde dice falso, right? Yeah, or no? Yeah. All yeah. right, okay. Mm -hmm. So, next to it, tenemos la sentence que está falsa. Y después de la sentence, we have the right sentence. ¿Qué quiero que hagan ahorita? Okay, just familiarize right now with the sentences, ¿sí? Y que quiero que escuchen algo. Solamente quiero que escuchen y después me van a decir si el resto de las sentences es true o es false. ¿Sí? Okay. Y vamos a identificar cuáles son false. So, let me just a couple of minutes. De, vamos a ver aquí qué onda. All right, a very good job.
-hmm. When you have familiarized with the sentences, let me know, please. Are you familiarized with the sentences already? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. Okay, cool. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna play right now the audio <laughs> and try to also read, okay? But most of that, what I want you guys is to try to pay attention on the listening part. That's what I want. Just pay attention, please. If you want to close your eyes, that will be wonderful. So you can focus 100% of the listening. Search nine, exercise four, <laughs> listening. Singapore solves it. Part A, listen to a resident of Singapore talk about how his city has tried to solve its traffic problems. Check true or false for each statement. Singapore has done a lot to try to solve its traffic problems. For example, to drive into the downtown business district, motorists need to buy a special pass. They can go into the business district only if they have the pass on their windshield. Another thing Singapore has done is to make it more difficult to buy cars. People have to apply for a certificate before they can buy a car. Not everyone can get a certificate. There's a limited number of them. There's also a high tax on cars, so a new one costs a lot of money. A car can cost three or four times more in Singapore than in the U.S. or Canada. The other thing Singapore has done is build an excellent public transportation system. Their subway system is one of the best in the world. And there's also a very good taxi and bus system. Okay, guys. So may I ask you, uh, the first one is false, but the second one, people need a special certificate to buy a car. Is it true or is it false in Singapore? True. 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 Okay. True. True. What about number three? There are enough certificates for everyone? True. 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 Okay. True. Number four, cars are more expensive than in North America? True. True. Uh, are you sure? False. 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 Uh -huh. False. Public transportation, what it says? Public transportation isn't very good. True. 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 You say true because you don't want to put the right sentences. <laughs> uh -huh. true. Are you sure? False. Yeah. Totally. <laughs> totally. A hundred percent sure. Yes. Mm, yes. I have my doubts. Singapore has done. Oh my god. It has done. Would you have would you like to listen one more time? No. Okay. We're going to listen. These guys next monday why because time is over okay uh, but if you want to Excellent. continue with me i will be more than happy Ooh. no <laughs> <laughs> uh, i know that carlitos wants to continue what his soccer game right <laughs> no 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 <laughs> just teasing Bye. you hey guys do you know that i sometimes i said i'm joking and sometimes i said i'm teasing you Mm. You know what's what? The, what is the difference between I'm joking, I'm kidding, I'm teasing you? I don't know. The yes. Is there a difference? Yes, yes it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. For example, if I said I'm joking or if I'm kidding, I'm, I'm trying. I'm saying that I try to make you laugh, guys, and try and do a joke for everybody. Okay, for everybody. What is joke? Joke is un chiste. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Kidding is a start of Broma. Exactly. Mm -hmm. However, pero estar bromeando con todos, with everybody, right? However, if I say, Carlitos, I'm teasing you, es decir que yo estoy joking, pero no con todo mundo. Estoy joking solo con Carlitos. Solo estoy molestando a Carlitos. I'm teasing you. Te estoy haciendo una broma a ti en particular. Teasing, teasing you. you. Joking and kidding is lo mismo. Pero teasing is ya bromear con una persona en específico. All right? 
Okay. So teasing is to, to making jokes with just one person in particular. So you see, guys, you learn a new word. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, so we will continue with this topic next coming Monday. And also we're going to learn something new as well. Okay, guys, uh, do you have any okay. questions with, about this topic? Any questions about the platform before we go? No. no. Monday. No. Monday. Tomorrow, tomorrow and uh, no, tomorrow weekend. No. I, tomorrow no, no, tomorrow and weekend. I but if you want to keep it with you. <laughs> check out the platform. <laughs> I get to get that platform. Okay, mm -hmm. guys, I wish you an excellent night, a lovely and yummy meal, an excellent cup of coffee, Alex. All right. <laughs> <Thanks. laughs> and also, Jorjito. All right. <laughs> have, have a blessed weekend. Okay, take care, guys. Bye-bye. 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 Bye. 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 Bye